Have you noticed it's become popular in business or pop culture to say, it's in our DNA about something clearly not linked to biology? It's one of my pet peeves. Anthropologists study human behavior from both the biological and cultural perspectives. So we get kind of picky about understanding to what extent each of these factors is driving that behavior. Any value or product a corporation is selling is clearly not coming from the biology or DNA of their employees, but there are aspects of human behavior that are driven by genetics, hormones, or bodily functions. For example, anyone who's gone through puberty or perimenopause can tell you how hormones impacted their experiences and behavior. So why does this distinction matter? Because if a behavior is biologically driven, it may be hard to control, require medical intervention, or just acceptance. But if a behavior is culturally driven, we have choices, individually or as a group, and those choices can change over time, which can be quite empowering. Stay tuned and next time we'll talk about the cultural side of this equation.